under your hair. Look at the wind under your hair. Okay, I'm gonna give you guys a quick history lesson on rat rods. It should only take a minute or two, and I know you guys skip to the good part because you have the attention span of goldfish, and that's okay because so do I, and that's why the electric Corvette still isn't done yet. Now a hot rod is a vehicle that's been modified with additional horsepower to increase acceleration. It's usually a rebuilt American car, two doors from the 30s all the way to the 70s. Now hot rods were loud and flashy, deviant versions of cars, and it usually has a more powerful big engine, loud exhaust, and generally associated with delinquents, riffraffs, and troublemakers. The engines were upgraded, but the brakes aren't usually upgraded, so you don't really drive them every day because you don't want to rear end someone. Now a rat rod is something that someone threw together to make a statement, and usually that statement is, I had a bunch of crap laying around and realized there was enough to put the car together, but I didn't want to put any effort into it. A lot of people said it has no floor or style, but on top of that, they decorate them with unnecessary items like spikes, bullets, grenades, plastic rats, garden tools, barbed wire, skulls, and oversized tools, which describes me perfectly so I bought one and we turned it into an electric rat rod. It was originally powered by a Chevy 350. Yes, we removed the Chevy 350 and put an electric powertrain out of an electric motorcycle. Yes, we built an electric rat rod years ago and it was on TV. It was the first one ever made and if you don't believe us, Google search electric rat rod and see what comes up. Well, the car gained so much attention that it was going to be featured in Hot Rod Magazine, but the higher up said no because it cut a little bit too deep and why it was getting more attention than the same cars they've been recycling for the same 74 years. After the rat rod was finished, I sold it to a guy that was going to put a gas engine back in it, but I regretted it ever since I sold it. I searched eBay Motors and Facebook Marketplace, and especially Craigslist, and want ads because generally old people use it, and look what shows up. Let's take a look at this thing. What's that, Steven? Is that a full service salon? Full service Brazilian. Interesting. What does that mean? Let's head in and find out. You think, you think they'll... Yeah. You do? They will. Yeah. Versus Brazilian. The whole time. Wow. I mean, I'm not, I'm not generalizing that Brazilians would do that, but I mean, it's... I mean, they're advertising it, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. They did advertising. I mean, full service means... Full service. Let's just say you go into like one of those full service salons. What do you, how do you ask for the full, like the last service? Because it's a service that a lot of people are going in there for specifically. How do you then take it to the next level and say, yes, now that you've cut my hair, I would like the remainder of the service now. Like, how do you say that? Like, how do you, how do you hint towards, you know, you go. Dude, the flat. Oh, that's the back. That's the right. All right, cool. Hold it up. Look at him dance. What was your initial impression when you first saw this thing? Oh, I loved it. I got it on Arizona. I mean, that's pretty much it. I mean, obviously I bought it sight unseen. Oh, no, it was just cool. I mean, he said it ran it, drove it. You know, he sent me a video. Sure enough, I got it back. I mean, I've driven it as far as, uh, you know, Bass Pro Shop. How far is that from here? Like, what's, what's the- It's like a half hour. Here? And you survived. Oh, what it is, it's pretty good. Uh, bikini top? Yep. The whole top comes Oh, that's off. like a drum, dude. That's, that's nice. Yeah. yeah, that's nice. Headlights work, brake lights work, doesn't have blinkers. Okay. Yeah. Hand. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, hand. It's titled as what? A 30? Yeah, 30, 31. Look at this. I, I know. It's, it's just. Richard. Steven. I what, mean. What do you want? God damn it. God damn it. Uh, this, is, this, is, these are the, this is what happens. Yeah. We, we browse, instead of pornography, we, we browse Facebook Marketplace, well, Craigslist. Well, wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Honesty is the best policy. Dude. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I was like, what was he saying? <laughs> so, like, you. BU was back up. Yep. F, like, so if you want to raise the back. Yep. Uh, FU was front up. That's just F the F way U, I did it. FU is what now? <laughs> FD is just F down. So, this one's to go back up, front yep. up, front down, back down. So, uh, like, front down. Man. This sits. Uh, see, like, completely, completely yeah, I see a lace frame, yeah. Uh, so this is just the on-off for the air. Okay. For the air pump. Yeah, the air tank. No, that's all that is. The people that have come to see it, how come they didn't leave it? Nobody's coming up there. Really? I kind of just blew people off and... 
I told you, I, I mean, I'm just being honest, I didn't really want to sell it. And right. It's just, I got so many things, I just don't use them. Yeah, I mean, there's really no story behind it. You're the, you're the first people that come with that. Was there, I thought in the picture there was something here before. No. I thought that uh, looked like it. This is the, the picture that you sent. Was, uh, the way you see it, I mean, the way it was in the picture is exactly how it sits. Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah, those pictures were last year, but I haven't, I didn't do anything to it. What's to do? It's, it's per uh, <laughs> you know, yeah. she's perfect. No, it's neat. Usually I change like wheels and tires or something. I didn't even. Yeah, this one. No, th those. Those. They yeah. kind of fit it all right. You didn't have to do anything with this one. I what? know. I, I just liked all the cool little, you know, like, you know, all the little accents. No, this thing, this thing is cool. Little accents and, shit and it's, it's just, cool. it was neat. It's cool. And like I said, I mean, I, mean, I, I didn't really expect it to drive. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, he told me it ran and drove, but you know, everybody's got a different perception. Of what, what, yeah. Like, I got some crazy things, some crazy pro street cars, you know. But sure. I mean, it runs perfect and it drives great. Right. I will. <laughs> it's a I'll just scream. It's technically street legal. I'll just scream. She's tight in there, but you know. Oh, but dude, <laughs> this is, is it a flywheel? Yeah, they just cut it in half to make it like a brace. Oh, that's cool. Disc all around? No, oh, drums in the Jump, yeah. The front's in most of the braking anyway, so it's fine. On this like is a, the truck. On like a one ton Dodge frame. From oh. the center up, pretty much custom. So you didn't you didn't build this? You bought this? Nah, uh, I mean I did some work, but pretty much the way you see it is pretty much the way I got it. Are you kidding me? Nice uh, mud flaps. All, all air ride, obviously. Oh my goodness. Twin turbo Cummins. The compound turbo Cummins, and it was a uh, nine with a twelve valve. Yeah, I do. I, I post them for sale, and then I and then I regret it, and then I don't sell them. So I right. got this guy. I think I posted it a year, uh, almost two years ago. Oh, this truck? Yeah. Yeah. For 30, 38. 38.5 or yeah. something. This guy in North, uh, South Carolina, he wanted it, wanted it, wanted it. I'm kind of dragging my feet, wanted it. Yeah. And then I'm like, I kind of just stopped answering his calls. He still the, calls the, the, me. The, 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 I, that explains the low sell rating. So, well, I told him I didn't want to sell, but he, yeah, he, so, he still calls me to this day. Almost once a week he calls me. Not answered his phone call in over a year. So you don't want to sell it? <laughs> yeah, I just don't want I just. You have it for sale just because, I guess. Well, no, when I first posted, I'm like, yeah, and then I had a couple of people interested. I gave my phone number. Oh, that's a, that's a and then, idea. Uh, you know, I took the post down, but he already had my phone number, so. Jack it up to 40. Yeah, uh, I just, it's just cool. I mean. They don't make stuff like this anymore. When, when's the last time you saw something that you intrigued you this way? And this guy, you know, the guy did a lot. Of, all those pulleys were all, he, he handmade all those pulleys. Dude, this is, the engine alone is worth that. That's a, that's a, that's a twenty thousand dollar engine. I mean, all day, every day. So I brought I brought this one and that the, the, I saw the Model A uh, to your, a Bass your... Pro. Yeah. And I towed it with that truck out there. So that was what, like a month ago. Yeah. I put them on the trailer. I drove yeah. them from the park right over. There. Yeah. But that's the first time I've had any of these out, and I've done anything with them for over a year. Did people offered to buy it from you. I bet they did. I mean, every once in a while. You know, yeah. They just, they're not for everybody. You know what I mean, some people look at them, they think it's so stupid or whatever. Yeah. Right. But then people, they, they get a massive heart. Oh, it's just, yeah. Like. But this has, you know, this is a dual, dual yeah. compressor. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the, the piping. Air, that's the air rod now. <laughs> ah, yeah, I love it. Uh, what what the actual yeah, I know, hell? Man. Oh, that spigot. So it's got, it's actually got a, it's got a tank under the seat. So you can put the nitrous, beer, yeah. whatever the fuck you Gator, want gator skin. Funny. Yeah. <laughs> they should light up. Yeah, they, they light up. That's too, Cut it out. That is, <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> that's obnoxious. <laughs> Dude, yeah. this is just a, come on, man. Like, it's just, a, it's just charming. It really is.
Home Depot right now, and I have some devastating news for us viewers right now. Steven impulsively decided to get a Fanta. He thought it was orange juice, and now we're he is. So yeah, yeah, I dude. That's so wrong. That's shame. I don't know what shame. it is. I don't get shame. this sort of thing. Shame. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, Steven, what are we going to do with you? What in the Rob Zombie? Come on, man. What in the Dragula you know, is this? You know what's this? funny? You know what uh, helped inspire this? It was the movie you told me about. Remember Mad Max? Yeah. I think when we had the old rat rod. <laughs> that was super fun. But ever since we sold it, it was kind of like a, the big empty. You know, we talked about this a million it, times, right? It was our biggest regret because yeah. we'd never sold anything. It was, and then we it sold was, that. We're it like, was that, and I kind of, I'm kind of kicking myself for selling that now because yeah. anything that's unique, you want to keep it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. The RS7 was great, but it wasn't really unique. This is. We yeah, so, so for everybody that doesn't know, Rich didn't see Mad Max for, oh, I don't know, until a month ago. I just saw it a month ago, yeah, right, on the plane back yeah. from California. It was a great movie, and then this would fit perfectly in there. And I, I you know I love Mad Max. I love, I, I never knew what the term Mad Max really meant, but now I know what the term Mad Max really means. I mean, this, this, this would fit perfectly in that movie. This, this would. It's right, right in. This also does fit in a Rob Zombie music video. I don't, I don't know, I'm not familiar with that. What's, is it, what's the genre? Is it rap? It's country. Get that country music? Good for you. Good for you. <laughs> so this is, man, I, I don't even know where to start, Stephen. Dude, where does one start? I, I guess know we could start, start with the blaringly obvious, this isn't the motor, it wasn't a 1931 Ford it, Model this, A. This was not, no. So you know what's funny? The, the rat rod was a Model A too. This? Yeah. Significantly smaller, yeah. actually. <laughs> yeah, I, th I think the wheel is like, literally right here. Yeah. Three feet right. shorter, yeah. Look at that. It was repowered, as they say, and this is a Chrysler Big Block 440. So it's a Chrysler 440, stock heads, stock exhaust manifolds, and obviously these are not stock. You know what's funny? These are the same, uh, these are the same pipes that are on uh, the front truck. They sure are. Yeah, the same flappers. The same type of flapper that we put on the mini bulldozer. Yes. Ah! <laughs> Seriously, right? <laughs> no, this thing is great. I rest think the, peace. the uh, rest in peace. Rest in peace. The, 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 just that the thing blew. Oh yeah, 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 right, right, right. Yeah, so this is um, it's great, man. It runs great. It drives great. All the other stuff that they add on it, they extended the frame at least another foot and a half, obviously. Dude, I'm still figuring things out myself. Dual, the more you look, the more you discover. I mean, it's a dual carburetor. At first, I thought it was a supercharger. Maybe we'll change that later. Who knows? But mm. it, it, everything is just great. The cantilevered front suspension. Come on, man. Look how much work and time went into this. Seriously, look at that. Look at that, Steven. The bags. I couldn't, I, it's just great. Oh. This, oh. Is, this is, this is, this is gonna, this is going away. Stop looking at me, you yeah. swine. Yeah, that's gonna, that's gonna go away for sure. But no. You like this? Uh-uh. What? Nope. You know a swan guy? This actually might go too. Actually, what, no, that'll stay. What kind of animal would you prefer? <sighs> a dog, a dog guy. A biscuit. Biscuit. Yeah. A little biscuit thing? Maybe, yeah, maybe after we, um, when and if Biscuit gets, you know, snip snipped. Oh, excuse put him me? Right, put him right here for us. Put us I'm dangling right there. No, no, have him be truck nuts in the back. Yeah, good point. Actually, yeah. good point. Yeah, that's a good point. Well, that's weird. Actually, you know what? Those I'm, are my dog's testicles. Yeah, this is. Sorry, sorry, And sorry, this big is how guy. we got canceled, everybody. Sorry, big guy. Say goodnight, Kevin. Yeah. <laughs> but no, stainless steel brake lines, someone put some serious work into. No freaking way. What's up? It's a piston. Oh, you just discovered this. I just discovered that. Yeah. I didn't even notice that. Dude, this is this whole thing is just you, you got you love to see it. You really yes, do you love do. to see it. Steven, his okay, I know what everyone's thinking right now. Oh, watching this video. Is it gonna be electric? The last one was electric. People complain when we pulled the engine out. It was a Chevy 350. No one wants a Chevy 350, to be fair. But also uh, at the time when we did it, nobody knew what a zero motorcycle really was either. And everyone was surprised. She surprised me, you know? She sure did. She surprised all of us. And yeah. I think as a result of that video, a few other cars were, were birthed with zero components. There was actually a couple of others in, uh, in the UK that they used zero motors for to power them. But here's the big question. Electric, what drivetrain and should we even do it? It's, it's, it's tough because how do you, 
the, the styling of this alone is, Steven, you saw it today. People didn't know, they freaked out when they saw this thing. How do you retain this look and still have a, and make it electric? You That's call uh, Web Motors? Right, yeah, have the fake block, good point. But is, is part of the fun the noise? And then what happens to these stacks? Do they stay? Do we have a, a flower pot in them? <laughs> but, but seriously, like a flower pot? I think the, bubbles, the, a little little bubble jar. Dude, the problem with this is that it it's um part of the coolness is the sound and the look, and it's the car. The car's obnoxious. It's obnoxious. It's, yeah. it's obnoxious. There's no other words for it. Yeah, the thing's obnoxious. So on the inside, again, we're still figuring this out too. This is the uh, this is the air tank of the solenoids. They're all look at that, dude. They're all hard lines. Usually it's the plastic lines that you see in a lot of builds nowadays. Ooh. The shifter, a B&M shifter, another piston. And then these chains to have the thing go up and down. Dude, it's just, it's cool. Rihanna would like that. She, she, Rihanna? Oh, yeah. Uh, no, no, yeah, no, no, no. Oh, Come yeah, on. yeah, she would. Come on, yeah. <laughs> I think you said Brianna. I was like, Steven, can I talk to you for a second? <laughs> That's that's my Ethan that's test. yeah that's clearly for, for yeah for look yeah that's just all, you, all you're gonna see when you come out back here yeah a, a looking through a letterbox yeah seriously is they being a peeping tom you really are you're a voyeur for that yeah I seriously. mean the fr even the front is though this is this is yeah this is not really much visibility especially it's, it's really with not. your your but, but you know you know what bugs me the most about this car the amount of cobwebs everywhere the guy never drove it he had this thing for over a year never drove it well what kind of spider makes those ones. Daddy long legs, for sure. Why do they call him a daddy long legs? A big daddy long legs. I think I know why. Huh? Yeah, why? Yeah, I think we all we all know why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but dude, even the the seats are cool. Every everything is cool. There's so much to look at in this car. It's not even funny. The seats are actually fantastic. Where are those seats from? Airplane seats? Old airplane seats? What else would that it be? It feels like it's out of an old airplane. Yeah, I don't do this whole. Th I, I can't. Ugh. But the only thing I would change, honestly, yeah, we the wheels. Yeah, the green doesn't really fit. It's with, not your color. No, it's not. Let's go with black. Keep it easy. Keep it simple. Why is everything going to be black? Everything has to be black. You're not black. Yeah. So first things first, black wheels and... Why did you shoot it? Yeah, oh, sorry. I didn't have to, <laughs> have to do that. That's awful cruel. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I mean, just excuse me, excuse me. You, shush, excuse shush, me. Shush, yeah, yeah. Shush, 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 shush. yeah, the tack doesn't work anyway, so it doesn't matter. But all these, all these are hard. This is awesome, Steven. These are all hard lines. They are super cool. You don't have to worry about any cracked hoses. No, this thing is great. Love it. Even these accents. Love to see it. You love to see it. You really do. You just do. God, I love this thing. I guess that's it. Like, what, what do we do? Is it electric to stay the way it is? We, we made an electric rat rod. Do we just, do we make another one? Is it too much of the same? Or do we make a more powerful one? I don't know, that last rat rod was kind of cool though. That last one was kind of cool. Well, in the meantime, let's, uh, you know, enjoy it the way it is. Yes. 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 Let's. 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 Well, how did you come across this? At Facebook Marketplace. We saw it and we said, let's go pick it up. So we just did. No oh, shit. Mm-hmm. Really? Where yeah. From? Up the street from here. No way. Yeah. We were pretty excited about it ourselves. What, what is it? I mean, it's a 1931 Ford Model A. Okay. That's somebody, you know, totally rat rotted. Somebody had their way with it. Yeah, they they uh, they did some things. Yeah. The more the more you look at, it, the more you discover things. You're just like, what a great way. Hallelujah. Right? A real car. <laughs> Genius. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I got to take a picture of this. Yeah. Oh. Can I take a picture? Yeah. Oh, $10. $10. $10. Free battery. Free battery. Oh, my God. That was $200, that damn battery. Of course it was. Damn, you guys, man. <laughs> Don't blame them. They're not the cause for very, inflation. Very disappointed in O'Reilly. Yeah. Are you? Oof. Battery. I'm starving. Yeah. Thank you, Stephen. Uh -huh. We need a microwave. Oh, we do. I know a place. You know a place with a microwave? Yeah. We're out of state. Follow me. Being on the go constantly doesn't mean you have to compromise on food. We've been eating Factor for months, as you've seen, and that's because Steven and I, we really, really do find them genuinely delicious, nutritious, and really easy to make. And I'm really lazy, and all you have to do is add is heat, and that's the best thing in the world for me because no one has that kind of time. You only need a microwave. You have a microwave, right? Of course you do. Like this one we found at a nearby auto parts store. Now you get pre-prepped meals ready in two minutes. 
faster than ordering my favorite takeout and no mess included. Factory even has add-ons like proteins, juices, energy bites, veggie sides, desserts, and more. And they also rotate meals to keep you on your toes so you don't get bored because I get bored very easily. And don't worry, Factor's snacks and desserts accommodate those following plant-based and keto diets and their dietitians doing the hard work. I have no idea about food, but we continue doing what we do best, which is whatever that is. Head to go.factor75.com slash richrebuilds120 and use code richrebuilds120 to get $120 off. What are you guys doing? What are you guys eating my break room for? Get out of here. You guys don't work here? Come on, there's oh, the we're, there. We're using the microwave. I saw the microwave here. I wasn't sure. Yeah, no, you can't. You guys gotta go. Well, we wanted to eat our factor. Can we finish? Sorry, no. Can we finish nope, first? You guys gotta go. Oh, well. Um. Uh, Look at this utility. Look, it's like a pickup truck. Just, just oh, that's perfect. Put your microwave right in yeah, there. right in there. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. It's good. Yeah, I like it. Nice job, buddy. This man has something to say, for sure. Hey, my father used to. Yeah, did he? <laughs> How are you? Good, man. Of course yeah, you can. Yeah, go nuts, man. Do you do that YouTube channel with all the Teslas? <laughs> oh, here we go. It comes. That's you? Yeah, that's me. Yeah. I watch this. You do? Yeah. Again. You shouldn't watch that. Shit. Just, it's just trash content, man. Is it? For yeah. the most part. Thank you. I'll back up a little bit so you can see the whole thing. No, there's, there's no adjustment in the seat. None whatsoever, Steven. This is great. This is, yeah, yeah. I know. I know, you're gonna burn your little toesies of yours. <laughs> yeah, right. Have fun, my friend. <laughs> Oof. Burn your little toes. Yeah. It's cool, isn't it? It's, it's, yeah, not, it's, it's, it's pretty cool. It's, it's, it's a 1931 Ford Model A, and it has a Chrysler 440, big block. <laughs> How could you not love it? You can't not love it. You can't. Isn't it? Isn't it great? Amazing. <laughs> I love this wheel. I know. It's such a boat. What do you think, Stevin? Look at the wind going through your hair. Look at the wind going through your hair. That's a good year. Look at that wood. Yeah. That's an old ass wood. 